The biographical drama Cabrini chronicles one immigrant woman's fight to build an empire of health, equality, and hope for the disenfranchised of New York City. I was told that you were rejected by three different orders, each time for weakness of constitution. Your Holiness, we can serve our weakness or we can serve our purpose. Not both. I knew very little about her. I had read something uh, in a chapter of, of uh, a book called, well, the translation would be Shut It Out, by the same author of uh, Gamora, the book that became then the movie and then the series. No, I think like a lot of people, I was familiar with the name, but it's always associated with institutions and probably knew that she was a saint. I had no idea why. I knew nothing about her, uh, completely anything. And, you know, I was very surprised that when I read her story, you know, I was shocked that I didn't know about her. My sisters, if we are to build an empire of hope, it seems we must first conquer New York. The main drive is how, you know, we must tell her story in the most cinematic and the most operatic way possible. That's how we started developing, you know, the language to tell her story. That's how we, everything kind of came together. In America, the greatest nation on earth, rats have it better than the children of five points. It's not safe, not for you. Be careful, this place will eat you alive. <laughs> this was a, a, a case in which I didn't, I didn't want to, and I couldn't, try to reach the character, understanding how she moved or why or how. It was the other way around. I had to let her values and beliefs and what, what she stood for speak for her, and that informed everything else. Doctors tell me five years. Five would be a miracle. In that case, I should get to work. He had actually sent a letter saying uh, he, he was aware that she was coming and saying, no, don't come here. You know, didn't want her to show up. And there she was in his office with a letter from the Pope. And what's he gonna say to the Pope? The reason I wanna do this role is you see that change over the course of the story and really through her influence and, you know, because she is who she is and he's changed by it. We have to show America we are all people of dignity. This project is overly ambitious perhaps unrealistic. I feel the, the job of a director is to break the prejudice that anybody might have about any given subject matter. When you hear the word non, you may build a prejudice in your head. That was one of the main challenges, how to break that right away. You know, as soon as you sit down to watch the movie, what is it that I can do to break the prejudice and take you on this cinematic journey? We are old or we die. This is how I learned to live in America. Made in Hollywood. Hey guys, thanks for checking out this video. We want to know, what would you have asked? Let us know in the comments below. And if you liked this video, don't forget to hit the like button. And as always, for more videos like this, hit the Emma HTV logo right here. And for the next awesome video, click right there.